Welcome back to Mango Plays Stardew Valley Expanded and hello Sophia. Are you just enjoying yourself by um, the bush? Yes, maybe you are. <laughs> hey you, I made us some coffee. Thank you very much. Hope you have a productive day silly. Thank you darling, you too. Okay. And Snoop bought us a gift. And uh, we have a letter. And we also have... Ha! I was wondering how I would find out about getting this. Um... Oh. Hang on. I have to gather them? Well... Oh. Um... I may not achieve this then. Okay. Um... Oop, oop. Stuttering. Dear Mango, I'd like to give you some information about an upcoming event, the Feast of the Winter Star. It's a time for the community to come together and think back on all the good fortune we've had this year. A favourite tradition is the Secret Gift Exchange, where everyone in town is ran or where everyone in town is randomly assigned to someone else. On the day of the festival, everyone brings a gift for their secret friend and surprises them, them with something special. This year, your secret friend is Hent. Don't tell anyone, the feast will take place on 25th from 10am to 2pm at the town square. See you then. Mayor Lewis, it will be Kent. Fantastic. Right, it's a shame I um, harvested the hardwood from here because that would have helped. I guess I will see how, many, how much hardwood I can harvest over the next four days. I didn't realise I had to harvest them. I thought I was just giving it to Robin. Oh, such a shame. But hey-ho. Let's just say hello to the animals. And then we will go check the hardwood areas. Hello, guys. How are you doing? Oh, the good old scratch. Let's, of course, say hello to the piglets. Hello. I can't wait for you to make me money again. Oh, we got a dino egg. We are starting to get more and more dinosaur eggs, which of course is um, the goal. But it is kind of nice to actually get a few every so often. Do you know what? I might buy the collection doodad from Marnie. Because, well, you know, let's face it. We have enough money. We should be able to. Right. I forgot about the shortcuts. <laughs> Hello! Let's um, grab as much hardwood as possible. Here we go. Right, so I got two there. I think it's two from every single one of these. Which, yeah, I'm not sure I could actually claim the 80. Oh. We could, of course, see if we can make the tree grower quickers things what i mean by that is tree fertilizer i do believe crafting um let's see tree fertilizer i wish there was a way um in short rapid growth even in winter See, that might definitely be a useful thing. Because we got 16 there. We'll get another view from the other zone. We might be able to do this, actually. So, let's grab some bits from downstairs. I do want to also um, make a... I will remember my words. I do want to make a travel to the desert totem as well. So let's see. Um, garden pots. Everything really looks so cool. Right. Um, let's do five of those. Uh, that's the worm bin. Okay. Um, and I wanted to do... We need a coconut. Oh no, did I sell them all? Uh, fruit. No, we got one. Ah. Phew. 
we go? Warp a desert totem. Let's um, also grab some seeds in a sec. And we will then plant these mahoganies down. Okay, right. Oh, uh, seeds. Be great once I get this uh, stuff fixed. Okay. Five. Is it just anywhere? Or do I plant them? I think I plant them first and then pop the fertilizer on them. Here we go. Perfect. All right, let's um, head down to the secret woods. We'll harvest the hardwood down there. Really should check my greenhouse as well. Sure, I was harvesting something for greenhouse. Hmm. I feel like it was star fruit for the Junimo in the secret, well no, not the secret woods, the woods down here. What are these called? Forest West. I believe that was the case. Right, let's see. We have... So we've just made 20. If I remember to do this on the next episode as well, we should get the 80 we need. Uh, yeah, should be fine. So, that's alright then. Okay. So let's use this. And away to the desert we go. We have a gift for somebody. Oh, that's perfect location. Hello. Hiya, Sandy. It's been a while. I closed the shop today so I could visit Emily. Okay, but you're here, which I'm very grateful about. Here you go. A Stardew Valley Rose? That's so lovely. Thank you. You're welcome, Sandy. Whenever I miss the valley, I'll smell this rose. Mm hmm? Here, take this. It's been on the shelf for 10 years and no one has bought it. You can have it. Thanks. Advanced TV remote. Ah. Oh, has more buttons than a regular remote. Perfect for the avid TV watcher. I know who might want this. It's going to be George. Isn't it? It's got to be. Yeah, let's return to the Stardew Valley. Thank you very much, Pam, for popping along here, knowing... Hang on, was I driving? Look, it's me, driving! Even that one was sitting on Pam's lap. <laughs> Thanks, Pam. Yeah, I think, I think George will want this. It's actually quite a nice um, art piece. I quite like it. Sprite. Oh, George, where are you? Oh, there you are. Hello! What's this? Ugh. So you push this button first. What's this button do? Mm -hmm. Ah! Well, how about that? It's a new channel! Here, take this. It's a stone I found when I was a coal miner back in the day. Funny thing, it's glow blue and stayed cold for over 40 years. Like magic. Received an arctic shard. This shard glows with an otherworldly blue light. Mm, let's see, who do we think? And obviously, we've got the dwarf. Magnus might, might, might want it. Demetrius. He might be interested in it. Hmm. Or the dwarf. Oh, I don't know. Well, tell you what, we're going to think about that and then we will come back and look. But for the moment, I'm going to head over to the islands. I know, I know. It's an addiction. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's grab, grab these bits because cause they are here. Uh, thank you very much. No, give. Thank you. I probably need to feed those with bait. Oh dear. Hey, yeah, Willy. Yes, thank you very much. Sorry if I smell like fish, eh? Oh, I really like that. That's nice. He occasionally says other things when he transports you over. 
And away we go. And here we are. Lovely. Right. So, there is a couple of things that I do know. There is some more dig spots for walnuts, like we found up in the top. Um, I can advise that they're down here. So, we've got our hoe. We're going to see anything that would. Oops. I have you. <laughs> in between those. Um, that's pretty nice. Now, we have. How many now? We have seven. We need to find three more. Okay. Now, I don't know. I saw there's quite a few big spots. Oh, okay. There's more, more sand over here. Oh, that looks suspicious. We have eight. And we have X marks the spot. That's got to be another one. Nine. Here we go. Now, I don't know how to get this guy still. Um, which is a shame. But we will grab that. Thank you very much. Um, let's see. Uh, this lady here, she won't talk to us until we've completed the quest, which we, we've done quite a bit on. Like, we've done quite well. Um, hang on, can I have my hoe, please? Get some more ginger. Seems quite important, this ginger. And why, why is this hoed up? I didn't do that. Hmm. Ooh. <laughs> How did we get ten? I thought we had eight. Was that a tree with multiple one? Oh. There we go. So, we have the ten that I wanted. <laughs> I love it. Um, I was expecting to have to go searching in this area as well. We've been down this bit. I remember doing that. We have... I think there. I can't get past here at all. Can I get down here? No. Nope. Okay. Yeah, I know you only want 10, but I, I want to do the bridge. I think the bridge is going to be much more interesting for us. I mean, I could save up for the additional gear, which, yes, I absolutely do want to do, but uh, I think opening up that other zone will lead to more um, walnuts for us. Absolutely. So let's head over, say hello to this parrot. Hello, parrot. Yes, please. Hairbridge? Yes. I'm broke. They have no golden walnuts. I'm coming for you, mate. Don't worry. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Oh, this is awesome. Look at all of this stuff. Oh, my. We got wild bait. And, of course, there is all of these goodies to um, pull up pretty much every time we're here. But let's um let's get this dude out. Maybe. Oh, maybe I need try something else. Yeah. Um F bombs somewhere. Um uh, monster loot. Let's drop that off. Ooh. We we'll drop the ribs off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Tools. No. Where did I put my bombs? In they crafted? Yeah, okay. Here we go. Stand back, mate. Stand back. Ha <laughs> ha that worked. <laughs> oh. Hello. How did you get trapped? Thank you. I thought I was done for. Yeah, I bet you did. I've been stuck in this cave for months. Wow. I'm impressed with your survival. I uh, can imagine you are thirsty. One more cave mushroom salad, and I would have gone off the deep end. Oh, so rubbery. Um, sure. Anyway, I'm Professor Snail. Hello, Professor. 
I've been conducting a survey of this island's flora and fauna for the last year. Truly, it's a remarkable place. I am fascinated with it, it has to be said. Well, I think I'll go back to my tent and freshen up a little. I'm afraid I smell like mushrooms. Hey, you should stop by the tr tent sometime. An enterprising individual like yourself would be a major asset in my projects. Hee <laughs> hee, farewell. Okay, see ya. Wow, can I go in here? You can! This is cool. Bless him. So he was just living off these mushrooms. That is um, pretty neat there. Right, let's um, get to the right tool page. Here we go. Right, okay. Um, So much to do. And I don't know if enough time. Okay, let's have a look up here first. That looks suspicious as all heck. Yep, there we go. Now, how do I get around to those? That is the question, I guess. It needs to be asked. Okay. We got two. Do I just cut down the trees? Like, hello? Hmm. Must have to come off a different route. Okay. Fair enough. But let's grab all of these bone fragments. They're going to be useful. <gasps> oh dear. Um, okay. I need to sort out my inventory first. Alright, there we go. We are getting lots and lots of seeds and clay from these. This is pretty cool. Of course, I'm getting the bone fragments, which um, is going to be important because there is a quest for getting um, a serious amount of bone fragments. Right, can I now walk along this edge? No, nope. apparently not. Okay. Hello, how are you doing? Have you met the others like you? I don't talk to them much. I feel safer with my own kind. Okay. Have I gifted you? Ah, oh, yes, I have. Okay. Never mind. Hello, Professor. Ah, come in. Yes. What do you need? And what will you give me? Welcome to my field office. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, what's wrong? As you can see, it's quite empty. Getting stuck in that cave was a huge setback to my project. Oh dear. But that's where you come in. Okay. Sure. I'm in the bone business, you see. Ancient bones in particular. And this island is full of them. So if you ever encounter any bones, fossils or mummified specimens on this island, bring them to my desk, okay? I'll make it worth your while. Thank you very much, Professor. All right, I, I have some stuff. Donate to the museum. <laughs> oh, wow, okay. We also to think generations have come and gone while this little bone lay hidden beneath the soil. Now it's mine. All right, I do have some more, actually. Um, Which I popped in here. Okay. Um, see if any of these is. Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. Fair enough. So, what's this about? Um, please report the number of purple flowers present on the island. I am not ready for that. I don't know. I've got to count these. Ooh. Okay. Pay me another dime. Um. Right. Now. Secrets. How? How do? Hmm. Ooh, hello. And I'm carrying this with me every time I come over. We've, we've done a lot of sifting out of the, um the sea. wonder if um, we will get 
any gold and walnuts from sifting. Hmm. Uh, let me uh, off these again. And you know what? I'm going to do a bit of fishing before we leave. Okay. Loads. We've got wild bait. Do you know what? That's absolutely fantastic that you can get wild bait from dig spots now. I am so on board with that. Oh! A golden walnut! Hooray! We're up to three again. <laughs> and then that's followed by trash. Lovely. <laughs> Wow, that is literally... We had golden walnut, trash, then golden walnut. I am down. Can I have golden walnut again? Oh. Okay. We got three golden walnuts. That is a, a neat way of getting a load of golden walnuts to begin with. And... Also got some treasure and another lionfish. So this is probably a super cucumber, which I just missed. Fair enough. I believe that the only new fish here is lionfish, which um, it's a bit boring. I mean. I guess it wasn't to begin with, but I was hoping for some more. Alright, let's um, make this our last fish, and then we will head home. Thank you. Yes, we will return to Stardew Valley. So... Tomorrow, definitely want to look into who might want the blue, um, this blue thing. Now, it could be, it could be the museum, but, oh, I don't know. It's in Vanilla Stardew Valley, and this questline comes from vanilla so we need to really only think about people we can talk to in vanilla um i would have thought oh i don't think i'm gonna make it home maybe i'll make it inside and then that lap's right there <laughs> come on i'd be able to crawl into bed oh there at least we made our ticket price back. That's all that I care about each day. To be honest, I'm not really worried about earning the money right now. I think come spring, that will we'll definitely be looking at trying to earn as much money as possible. But right now, not too fast. Okay, let's drop that off. Um, these get used. Um, hmm, yeah, I don't think, I think just sell them, to be honest. Um, there we go, let's get that sold. Let me just sort out my inventory because it's getting a little bit ridiculous. Right, there we go, inventory sorted. Hey, I found this in a drawer somewhere, thought you could use it. Um, <gasps> Energy tonic? Lovely. Um, do you know what? I could use it right now. I'm a little bit exhausted. Thank you very much, Pam. Oh, good old energy drink. Dear Mango, I'm at my wit's end. I desperately want to make a Coco No-No at the saloon. But I have no way of getting a coconut. Can you help me? Yes, absolutely. I have one in my, in my cupboards somewhere. Uh, fruit. One coconut. Actually, one iridium coconut. For you. Hello, Snoop. How are you doing? Right, okay. Let's 
remember and go do hardwood collection. It's important. Um, and then we will go and see Marlon and try and work out who would like the Arctic Shard. As well as seeing Gus with the coconut. I don't think we're going um, to the island today. Because, uh, let's face it, I've been there quite a few times. We can visit here for some reason. <laughs> oh, do you know what? I wanted to do a test. Do I have any chests left? I don't. I should hopefully have some wood. I don't have enough wood. Okay. I will attempt to remember that test for another time. Someone remind me in the comments. <laughs> um, I wanted to see. I read on one of the update notes that the uh, mushroom pro propagators. Is that the right word? Let's see them on here. Uh, this is the propagator. Um, they now accept automation from uh, but the automation model. Which, if that's the case, this is going to be fantastic. Um, we'll be able to not worry about them. And we can definitely start making some serious money from the um, mushrooms down in that area. I think that's the perfect area for the mushrooms. I know I could use it for kegs or casts. But I think, realistically, our cellar is large enough for kegs and casts. I don't need to... Uh, worry, I don't think about that. Uh, let's go here and head out. Right, did I say hello to the animals today? I don't think I did, so let's uh, drop in. I was about to say, maybe I did. But no, it just took a minute. There we go. Hello, guys, how are you doing? Glad the radiator hasn't broken or anything. Hello, how are you? Do you know what? I probably should look at purchasing more animals as well. I mean, we've got, we're sitting on a fair whack of money, but I am consciously thinking that I should. Hello. Um, should probably hold that for the first of spring. Um, hmm. Oh, Knuckabell. Like it. Yeah, I'm thinking probably for the first of spring would be a good time, really, for spending all of that money. We are going to need a lot of seeds come spring. And it's year three as well. I think some of the mods that I have will release new. Uh, combinations no new plants from the third year so I definitely want to make sure that I'm investing in that and also let's go check out what I was thinking about in here oh yes I I, I need to find fix for this rats ah I'm glad I have those on me I really need to make some more <laughs> oh dear yeah definitely need to find out what the fix is for that um let's go the other route in and then it's up here here we go star fruits now i can't remember how many i needed so let's harvest all of these and we'll go look where I think these are. I think I needed more than what I have, 83. Let's go find out. Um, yeah, we can exit through this door, I think, though. Ooh. Drop these in. Actually, I need to drop them in, actually. So, greenhouse. There we go. We are turning all of our ancient seeds in, or ancient fruit into ancient seeds. If you can't remember, because we want a full greenhouse of ancient fruit at some point soon. 
head over this way. We'll see the traveling merchant when we pick up the hardwood. Hello. Um, unmilled rice. Oh, that seems interesting. Nothing um, of massive interest to me, unfortunately, but I am curious about the rice. It's something I've never actually grown. Um, maybe in spring. We'll get that done. Okay, let's face this way. And this way. Now, I've just had a thought, actually, which, hmm, maybe we need to explore that in the next episode. The, so if we look here, we've got 56 with three days to go. We should be all right. I think the wood that grows on the new island is hardwood only. So we might be able to um, progress that collecting hardwood section from there easily. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Maybe. Right. Let's go this way. We need to go to Aurora's Vineyard. Right. I believe in here, up here, yes, this thing. That was what I was thinking. Let's see. 200 star fruits. Okay. So I think let's run those and those through the seed maker. And then we will, oh, maybe in community chest? There's something in here that I can, we probably want to sell all of these. I'm gonna sell that as well. So uh, let's drop the star fruit in there. That's where we're keeping our quest stuff. And then we will hopefully remember, fingers crossed. I'll probably go, why do I have so many star fruit seeds? And I next look in that chest. <laughs> right, Marlon, I'm on my way to you. Okay, before we check out Marlon, I do want to see whether or not Vint or the museum is the place for this Arctic thing. So let's go in here. Oh. Hmm. Fascinating. Well, the fact that I've only got eight things left to get. Ah, Miss Mango. I'm just taking a gander at the wonderful minerals, gems, and artifacts you donated. There's a great many mysteries waiting to be explored in this very room. I know. All of this was possible because of your efforts. With the knowledge we've gained from these treasures, we can now ask ourselves the question. Okay. What is the history of Stardew Valley? Um, other civilizations once existed here. Magic at every corner. A violent past. There isn't enough for me to come to a conclusion. Um, magic at every corner. Stardew Valley is a magical place. I concur, Miss Mango. Ah. Oh. No matter how you look at it, Stardew Valley is a magical place with sacred importance. Indeed, Gunther. Together, we'll make a discovery that will change the world. Uh, is it this ice thing that I have? Um, let's find it. Do you want this? Wrong a person. Okay. So let's try Clint next, because, you know, he's right next door. Hello? Clint? Clint isn't here? I do not recall a time when Clint was not... I, I don't think I ever have come in here when he's not working. Clint, where are you? Um... Yeah, nine till four. Oh, look, there's a little gift above Marlin's. That is nice UI. Um, then. Oh, he's in the community centre. Oh, that's cool. Let's head up to the community centre then. I don't like um, seeing the Jojo Mart all boarded up like that. 
I like Shane and... Oh, is it Martin was the new guy that was working there? I mean, oh, yeah, Martin. We had... It was a lady as well. Uh, let's see if I can see her. No, can't work out. Hmm. I have a feeling it was a P name. Claire. There we go. Oh, I don't have any stars with Claire. Or hearts, should I say? This is not where I wanted to go. I wanted to go to the community centre. That's here. Then... Are you down in here? You are fantastic. Are you the right person? Mmm, <gasps> that's an interesting stone, like nothing I've ever seen before. I wouldn't know what to do with it, though. I deal in the mundane, not the magical. Right, okay. So, not you. I was excited for a second. Um, yes, I, I must remember to do that soon. So, right, I'm going to try Demetrius first, here because he's right here, wrong person. So we're going to try the wizard <laughs> after we have wished Marlon a happy birthday. Oh, hey, hello. Oh, I can finally sell this stuff. It's been in my drawers for ages. Um, hmm. Oh, look. Oh my word. Three energy, one health, two mining, two luck, 20 max energy, two magnetism, two speed, and three attack. And it's worth 5,000. Or it costs 5,000. How long does it last for? Um, yes, we'll have void salmon as well. Thank you for the recipes. Um, okay. What do you want as a gift, Marlon? Um, rabbit's foot can do that, no problem. Um, there we go. A birthday gift, that's very kind of you. I love it. Good. Do you want this? No, okay, thought you wouldn't. Um, uh, what about you? Camilla, our witch, sent me here to seek audience with Marlon. You know, he's a legend where I come from. He's a legend here. Hello, wizard. Uh, do you want it? Ah. An arctic shard. A most powerful substance, indeed. And potentially infused with the element of ice. I'll take it if you don't mind. Sure. Uh, you're still here. Oh, you want something. Take this. A wriggling worm. Oh, well, we know who wants this. This one's easy. Um, we, we need to give it to, um, to Willie. Surely. What's it say on it? It's a wiggling wet worm. Oh, how lovely. Right. Uh, at this time of night, Willie will probably be in the saloon, especially on a Friday night. Hey, here's Willie. Ah, that's the perfect bait for a catfish I've been trying to catch. Here, let me trade you this for it. I'm not sure what it is, but it washed up on the beach not too long ago. Aha! Something tells me you could use it, miss. You received a pirate's locket. Oh my, is this the end of the chain? It's an old pirate's keepsake. I, I think it is. Because if I remember rightly... Find a keepsake that belonged to Birdie's husband. Pirate locket. It's an old pirate's keepsake. Oh my. This is pretty cool. So, uh, you wanted... A coconut, didn't you? Coconut, now there's a soothing sight for my winter eyes. It's going to be perfect for my Coco no, no Thanks. You are welcome, Gus. Business has been really good tonight. I'm pleased. Good. Let's see. Um, got any recipes for me? You do. A big bark bur burger with a puffy fish, okay? And a glazed butterfish recipe. 
Sounds great to me. Loves this, Sophia. Yeah, of course so. Let's get a few of these. Ah, avocado eel roll. Ooh. Banana bread. Oh, man. Barley tea. Berry fusion tea. We need to use blueberry seeds for this. Okay. Blue mist tea. Breakfast tea. <laughs> Chai tea. <laughs> oh. Crab roll. Oh, my. There is so many recipes. There is so many teas here. Cake pops. Oh, my. Oh, croissant. Hot cocoa. Oh, lovely. Um... Ah. There is so many recipes here. Oh my. I'm going to go broke just buying all of the recipes. Bunny cotton candy. Okay, we're, we're going to stop. Look at this. I can't afford all of them. We'll, we'll do that. And I'm not saving for a mass amount of seeds. <laughs> oh, yeah. And we completed our exotic quest. Uh, spirits quest. Thank you. <sighs> oh, I'm so excited to see what Birdie thinks. We, we found her necklace. This is awesome. Ah, oh, yeah. I wonder what the reward will be. And hopefully... i just got to remember. For the next episode, I've got to remember. I'm going to gather... Oh, 24 more bits of hardwood. Shouldn't be too difficult. Oh my god, we made it to bed before Sophia. Where is she? Hello? Hello, Snoop. How are you doing? Oh no, sorry. Go back to sleep. I was just saying hello. Do you like these lights? Um, It's definitely, yeah, definitely going to be important. Let's go to sleep for the night. Ah, oh, 11,000. Thank you. So, how... Oh my god, is Granny's birthday? Or Evelyn's birthday? It is Granny's birthday. So we've got until the 25th for the Feast of the Winter Star. We've got a little bit until um, birthday. But we do have a loved gift here you go oh this is one of my favorite things i always treasure it no eat it sophia <laughs> hey you made us some coffee thank you very much hope you have a productive day silly indeed <laughs> oh less well that is where we end today's episode these obviously are not going to grow in time for the robin's quest but uh um, hopefully you enjoyed today's episode if you did don't forget to leave me a like it really does help out the channel leave me a comment down below let me know anything i should get done um or just how you're doing that would be great and as always i will see you in the next one bye for now